Hi all, welcome to TriTree Technologies. Join Telegram channel for any queries. Today we will learn about Linux and its history. If you've never worked with Linux before, you may be confused as to why there are so many different versions of it available. We're sure that you've heard various terms such as distribution, live DVD, and GNU when looking at Linux packages and been confused. Wading through the world of Linux for the first time can be a tricky experience. Some of the mystery out of the Linux system before you start working on commands and scripts. For starters, four main parts make up a Linux system. The Linux kernel. The GNU utilities. A graphical desktop environment. Application software. Looking into the Linux kernel. The core of the Linux system is the kernel. The kernel controls all the hardware and software on the computer system, allocating hardware when necessary and executing software when required. If you've been following the Linux world at all, no doubt you've heard the name Linus Torvalds. Linus is the person responsible for creating the first Linux kernel software while he was a student at the University of Helsinki. He intended it to be a copy of the Unix system, at the time a popular operating system used at many universities. After developing the Linux kernel, Linus released it to the internet community and solicited suggestions for improving it. This simple process started a revolution in the world of computer operating systems. Soon Linus was receiving suggestions from students as well as professional programmers from around the world. Allowing anyone to change programming code in the kernel would result in complete chaos. To simplify things, Linus acted as a central point for all improvement suggestions. It was ultimately Linus's decision whether or not to incorporate suggested code in the kernel. This same concept is still in place with the Linux kernel code, except that instead of just Linus controlling the kernel code, a team of developers has taken on the task. The kernel is primarily responsible for four main functions. System memory management. Software program management. Hardware management. File system management. Thank you for watching our videos. Please subscribe, share and comment down your queries. Do not forget to click on bell icon.